How to Make Hair Bows for Little Girls Little girls just love to have ribbons and bows in their hair. Trend-setting teens and grown-up women also love them. Although you can find hair bows of many sizes available in stores, you can actually make your own and save a little money. Listen to learn how to make hair bows for little girls that are just as fantastic or even better than the ones you find on sale in shops. Among the advantages of making these bows in the comfort of your home includes the fact that you can choose how big or small they can be. They're easy to make, and you can give these items as gifts. You can also make hair bows to order and earn a little on the side. They also make good fundraising drive items or party favors. Making hair bows can also be a worthwhile activity to do with female friends and family members. You will need, first of all, a few spools or yards of cloth ribbon in different sizes, depending on the size of bows you want to make. For a start, try to choose ribbons with textures that are easy to work with, since those with a sleeker, more slippery feel will be difficult for you to work with. When you've been making hair bows for a while, you can try more luxuriously textured ribbons. You will also need a glue gun or a needle and thread, a pair of scissors, and some barrettes or hair clips. You can find all these materials in craft or sewing shops. A ruler will also be of help in case you would like to make precise measurements. If you have all these, you can now follow these instructions. 1. Measure how long you want the bow to be and cut a length of ribbon twice as long. Add an inch to allow for overlap. For example, for a hair bow that's 3 inches long, cut 7 inches of ribbon. 2. Cut a 2 inch piece from the same ribbon. This will gather the first ribbon into a bow. 3. Join the ends together using the 1 inch allowance you've made as overlap. Secure by gluing or sewing. 4. If you are using needle and thread, take the needle down through the middle of the loop and put the thread from beneath the middle of the bow to the top. Loop your thread around the center of your bow. Gather the thread to make the middle of the bow form into shape. Secure this by sewing in a few stitches to keep the folds in place. 5. Take the smaller length of ribbon and wrap it a little tightly around the middle of the larger ribbon. Seal the loop by sewing or by using the glue gun. 6. Get a barrette that's just the right size for your bow. Glue or sew the bow to the barrette. If you are using a glue gun, apply a little pressure on the bow for a few seconds after gluing it to the barrette. You now have a basic hair bow. With a little practice, you can experiment with different textures and widths of ribbon. You can also try making bows in different layers of ribbon or add embellishments to them using beads or rhinestones, whether it's for making hair accessories for your daughters, for giving as gifts for friends and family, or for jump-starting a small business venture. Knowing how to make hair bows for little girls is a craft that you will definitely love.